To completely uninstall SQL Server Management Studio from your system, you will need to remove the application itself and clean up some leftover files and settings. So let's do it. For this go do search and type control and select control panel from the list. Here select view by category option. Then under program select uninstall program option. Here search for SQL Server Management Studio. Right click on it and select uninstall. Here just click on uninstall button as shown here. Just wait for some time and it will uninstall Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio along with its components. Next click on close button. This will auto remove SSMS related components like Azure Data Studio, Visual Studio Shell isolated if you have installed a Microsoft old DB driver for SQL Server. Now let's look how to remove leftover files of SSMS from your system. Now just remove Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio 20 and Microsoft SQL Server from following Only delete those files if it exists on following location from your system. If it does not exist then move to next steps. At last let's clean up user profile leftovers. For this press Windows plus R to open run dialog box. There type percent appdata percent and click on OK button. You will find yourself inside roaming folder. There navigate to Microsoft folder. There search for SQL Server Management Studio and then just delete that folder. You can press shift plus delete to delete the folder permanently. Now just refresh and you will find that folder gets deleted successfully. Now go to to update a folder. Then navigate to local folder. Next navigate to Microsoft folder. There search for SQL Server Management Studio and then delete that folder as well. Now just restart your PC and SQL Server Management Studio 20 should be completely removed. Please like share and subscribe to the channel. Also click on bell icon so that you will not miss any update.